Hello, I am Dr. Uday Jadhu, consultant in cardiology at the MGM New Bombay Hospital. Uh, it was a pleasure and privilege to present the RAS1 study at the Epicon 2019 on behalf of our principal investigator and my senior colleague Dr. Jamshed Dalal and investigators from all over the country, all four zones of the country which were involved in this very major first real world data on Azil Sartan compromising 839 completed patients. So what we found is that Azil Sartan worked very effectively in terms of lowering the systolic blood pressure and the diastolic blood pressure. The systolic blood pressure reduction was to the tune of about 30 millimeters and uh, diastolic blood pressure to the tune of about 14 millimeters. This data is very consistent with most of the uh, international studies which have compromised uh, either azelsartan as a monotherapy or in combination with chlorothalidone. As we have shown in the past, the combination of azelsartan with chlorothalidone is more effective in reducing the blood pressure, systolic blood pressure as compared to azelsartan with hydrochlorothiazide. One of the very relevant and important aspect of this study was the age group. We had an age of 54.1 on average. So we looked at a younger population as compared to most of the international data. Now this suits our country very well because in general the prevalence of hypertension is more among the youngsters as, it, as the data comes up in our country and more below the age of 60 years. We have neither guidelines nor sufficient data to recommend either a class of drug or a choice of drug. As in certain in this subgroup also worked as effective as in the entire group to the same tune of about 30 by 14 millimeters of mercury. So the message is if you have a young hypertensive here is a very potent ARB with a very good receptor affinity with a very good 24 hours efficacy with excellent effect on nocturnal blood pressure and the morning surge of blood pressure. We also looked at the subgroup analysis of uh, patients who were um, uh, uh, ACE or ARB naive and also a subgroup of diabetic patients and we showed the same level of efficacy. I am very happy that we have generated data on a new molecule, a new ARB uh, of azelsartan as compared to the other older generation of, of ARBs where we have reasonable amount of data. But this being the first real world data should encourage us and motivate us to do further studies and of course test the clinical efficacy of this drug. It has been popularly used and we are very happy about it in the last two years. I take it forward from here and we are now enrolling for the RAS2 study and we will look at patients who will be given azelsartan and study both for central aortic blood pressure and for ambulatory blood pressure. Thank you.